guys, Struggler here, and welcome to another Redstone tutorial. Today I have for you a chest swapper, and what I mean by that is it will toggle through each of these chests up front at a flick of this button. Uh, it has nine chests in the system, and if you press it, it will go through each of them. I put a different item in each of those to show that it was going through them. So this one has a button. If I press it again, <coughs> got a comparator. And by the way, we are on uh, the plastic texture pack. Uh, I like this a lot better for redstone. I actually do have a couple changes, like the redstone I use code crafted stuff because it shows the redstone a lot better. So that's just for everybody that's going to ask what texture pack are you using? Plastic. <clears throat> Anyways guys, let's uh, show you how to build this. Okay guys, let's get on with this. What you're going to need for this build is uh, nine chests. You're going to need two sticky pistons. You're going to need four regular pistons. You're going to need one redstone torch. You're going to need a handful of redstone. Uh, needs, I believe, 16 repeaters, two comparators, you're going to need your blocks of choice, you're also going to need a button and some stairs, and that is it. So let's go ahead and get on with it. So we're going to start off by going three blocks right here we're just going to build off of these three blocks our chest will be popping up right here so let's go ahead and just block that in so you should have a little square like this uh, you're going to go out from this block one two three four Put a temporary black right there and a sticky piston right there and then another one in front of it uh, actually that black can stay there because we're going to use it uh, then you're going to place a block right there and another block right there <coughs> then you're going to take your first chest and place it right there Next you're going to come to this side, you're going to take repeaters, you're going to place one there, one there, and one there. Both of these ones are on four ticks delay, and one there on four ticks delay. Go put redstone dust right there. I'm going to switch this out because it's kind of part of the circuit. Go place a torch right there. You should see your uh, chest pop out. And if we did the timings right on this, if we break this torch. Oh, I know why. We didn't finish this. You're also going to place a redstone dust right there. So if we break this torch, it should pull the chest all the way back. Which it does. Good. Go ahead and replace that torch. Uh, next, what we're going to do is we're going to break here and here and there. Just grab some redstone, place it there. Then you're going to build up the wall here. Two blocks this way and then one block this way. The build is six by six, and then I believe it's one deep, so four total. So now we're going to place a repeater there, and that's just so our redstone signal doesn't get mixed up in that. 
going to get some redstone dust connected to the stuff we just placed and you go out right here then you're going to place one dust there and then you're going to put four repeaters going this way all on four ticks so they should be at full delay and that will go right there and place the dust there we'll get back to that next we're going to place a pulse extender right here let's see I'm just going to replace some blocks this is actually where the pulse extender will be gonna put one right there and one right there gonna put two dust there one there gonna put a full block right there to cut that signal off then you're gonna place two dust right there and then you're gonna take a repeater going into this block right here let's see I'm going to now place in our regular sticky pistons her regular sticky pistons that made no sense now we're going to place in our regular pistons I'm going to place one right there facing this way then you're going to place one right here No, you're going to place one right here, then you're going to place one, not like that, right there. So this one should be right here, this one should be butt up against the wall, and yeah. The next one will be in line with the back of this piston over here, right here. See how it lines up with the back of the piston, and then it lines up with this part of the wall. Then our final piston will be in line right here, and all the way at the back. Face this way. And there you go, that's where the pistons go. Now we are going to go ahead and place a black there this is more decorative than anything because when it pulls all the way back you'll be able to see the sides we're also going to use it for some circuitry place a black there place blocks going all the way over here then place blocks right there and then place blocks here Okay, now we're going to get back to this delayed circuit. I'm going to just continue the line up here over the piston to the end. Then you're going to take two repeaters. This one on two ticks delay, this one on four. Then you're going to take some more redstone dust to the end. Put a repeater going into this block on two ticks and then on the other side of the block put a repeater on four ticks delay then more redstone dust to the edge then two more repeaters this one on two ticks this one on four ticks and then two more dust and that should let me make sure should be everything yeah, that's everything on the circuit. Now we just need to place our chests. So what you're going to do is you're going to place a chest here, here, and here. Not going to place one in this corner. 
then you're going to place one right here now I go to place one in this corner go to place one right here and here again not one in that corner and then one there and there don't worry about that chest linking up as soon as the pistons move the chest they will be unlinked and they won't link back up so let's go ahead and give this a try we got to go ahead and get our one button out have buttons right there And then uh, that's right you need uh, stairs or some kind of transparent block because otherwise if you put a full block above your chest you won't be able to open it so you can use half slabs uh, glowstone all that kind of good stuff but I like putting a upside down or a, a stair that's backwards and it looks like a full block but you can still open your chest and then your uh, button goes right below the chest you press it switches out and as you can see the chests aren't linked anymore and they won't link back up and you just press it and we'll continue on so that's it for the tutorial guys uh, if you enjoyed it please leave a like and subscribe if you already have it uh, go ahead and give me any suggestions you have uh, just leave them down in the comments uh, just realize that I will put your suggestion on a list and I will eventually get to it and the list right now is kind of big so it might be a while but I try to get in any requests that I am given so keep that in mind Anyways, guys, have a nice day. I'll see you next time. Bye.